Are you ready for the the Kaze Kage? No. Doki me. <laughs> that was three characters in one. That was Mary trying to be Sunsun as Shizune. <laughs> oh my god. Are you ready for the Kaze Kage? Not Kaze Kage! The Kage hey, Summit. <laughs> We're just ready for the Kaze Kage. The- Where are you going, Aura? <laughs> See, the problem is when I look straight, there is a big old line in my frame of reference. So the whole screen, I have to be like. <laughs> Soy talk! Oh, this is fire, I think. <laughs> Water pageant jutsu. Welcome back to Pageant Perfection. Covering, aye, aye, aye. covering RuPaul's Drag Race Season 15, Episode 10. Yes. It's Ugh, we're on the yummy episode. Who? The <laughs> rock. <laughs> but ten. Yeah, episode ten. No, yummy was ten. It's supposed to be ten, but then he turned out to be zero. That is straight doo doo garbage. Don't Come on. Anyways, with me, I have to the Kage summit a Kage of truth. And honesty and fairness, only giving out the best scores. Correct. The three I did is here once again. Sweet talk, sweet talk, sweet talk, sweet talk, sweet talk. Sweet talk. <laughs> water, 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 water. This is the water episode because I am Terumi May, Christmas tree May. And I am. Um... <laughs> Sister, welcome to the stage where tonight we're covering Night of a Thousand Beyond Size. Pick a better person next time. Farewell, sister. Uh, I feel like mm -hmm. a lot of the looks were kind of like whatever today. Yeah, I feel like the executions was fine, but I will say Beyonce is a high standard to have. Because That's another thing. I feel like some of these girls just didn't even have a chance, considering. No, ugh, well... The bag of carpets. <laughs> I wait. Look. Oh! <laughs> they got you, gal. But let's see if tonight we're going to be judging the looks, mm -hmm. which category is... Night of a Thousand Beyonce's. Wig of a Century. Okay. May, we please have a good episode. Get your life. First up coming to the Eastage is... Anidra! Can I just say, yes. Anidra looks so beautiful out of drag. Like Gorgeous. Beautiful face. But she's beautiful. <laughs> right. Sonic! <laughs> beautiful mug idea <laughs> hmm. okay so i'll start if you don't mind go for it i think once again i myself have placed myself under the anitra genjutsu <laughs> because i think this is fine this is okay there's nothing groundbreaking anitra always loses me with the shoes she never wins the shoe category with me. This one was awful. I mean, I, to be fair, I don't remember what Beyonce's shoes were considering chopped right. at the ankle. <laughs> but I just think that even if she did wear these black boots, change the black boots. For me, once again, the Genju 2 is playing. So I'm feeling fine. So it's a five. Fine five. Once again. I need you just good. Like, it's just, it's never See, the T. I think what also me. held back for me as far as, like, the look is her makeup choice, like the colors. You want her to give a little bit more Beyonce fish illusion? No, not oh. Sephora makeup, but like, oh, wait. It's just the, I think it's the bright white killing me on it because it's like a very gold inspired like theme. I love Even the colors. With the purple. Gold and purple always like royalty. Compliment. Right, they complement. Honestly, well. Anitra looked great. I'll give her a six. The boots really kind of threw me, Fugu but I man. loved the billowing cape, and I think the dress is. The tone is great. Like, it coochie-cutted right at that, like, perfect level. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Nevitra, good job. Feeling As fine. usual. <laughs> exactly. It's clean, concise, and correct. 
You go first. Oh, 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 ah, wait. <laughs> I'm never expecting that. <laughs> Next up coming to the stage is Miss Lucy Bussy, Looney Tunes Lucy Laduca. Looney. Be quiet. I need her to She stop. told me to go first and then she shut me the fuck up. <laughs> Go, sister. Go, go, go. No, 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 no. I just, before we get into actual looks, you can go first on the looks. Okay. But I have this to say. Oh, yes. She is so surprised that people are like, oh, is she going to get mad again? Girl, do you not hear yourself every single day? It's like, I know, okay, the edit, but still, it's like. And on touch, she said she was mad three times. Every time a new group of girls came in, she's like, I'm so mad I'm not on the top. But did you know I was so mad I wasn't on the top? But I won two minis. I know you healed Minis. all of Konoha, but I'm mad that I wasn't in the top. <laughs> you learned the 1,000 healing jutsus. I'm mad I wasn't in the top for that. But I'm too busy gambling. To right. Care. So, it's just like the attitude is just not there for me. And it's very much like your outfits are mid. Like, there's very few outfits that you have that are actually good. Like, even this one. This is giving me talk show host versus Beyonce. Like, the blazer is like a weird length. I'm, I'm going to save you some time. Lucy. It's a zero. Yeah. <laughs> no belly. You could have. You didn't even have to do a belly. You could have done like something big and round and made it funny. You know, because this looks like normal Sephora mom tees. Right. Dressing up as Beyonce for Halloween. Lucy, you know what this is. I need you to wake up. It's a zero. I'm so sorry, daughter. I'm not sorry. <laughs> Get your Christmas tree under control. One more. Mm. She needs a moment. I need a bobby pin. Next up coming Ooh. to the East Stage. It's Lux Noir London. And while you explain, I'm going to fix my wig. Okay. So I see the inspiration, obviously. Mm -hmm. And she looked very beautiful. Mm -hmm. However, there were aspects of it that I wish were different. Mm-hmm. That would have made this better. Okay, so we're on the same train of thought. Because my score is very simple and I don't have nothing to say. So when I'm done fixing this wig, it's over. Okay, great. Uh, what I hate about it is, <laughs> is the choice of leggings. They're too... They're too bright, girl. Yeah. And I understand, like, there is the way to, like, stain stage them lighting. and, like, fuck. What leggings are you wearing that's affected by stage lights to make them brighter? Just, just say they weren't dyed enough. Because then if it's stage lights, then it's, like... I don't believe it. Anyway, ah! um, I just think maybe a bare leg would have been great and just like really slicked up and oiled up. Cause like, look at her arms. Her arms. The problem for me wasn't even any of that. Hold it on. was the wig. Oh, I wasn't there yet. I wish that the because it's a two toned wig. It's like black and like a brownish. I don't like color. the sh like the length of it. Okay, needed more volume, especially for a big curly wig. And then also, I wish. I know. I wish there was just some blonde in there to brighten it up. It's like too close to her skin tone, which I mean, like, is a look because I know she's supposed she's to be Beyonce. She's true to the character. Yeah. But this look was also fine. So they I'm, were, mm -hmm, you I'm know. feeling fine. So fine for me because it's not bad. It looks correct. But is it enticing me? And do I think of like, oh, Night of a Thousand Beyonce's? It's like, I hold can't. on. I would argue, I would give her a six because okay. I think that it is beautiful. Like, as far as like the bodysuit and how it like matches that. And then uh, Rue also wore it too. It's like, okay, they were eating it up. But what really bothered me was the fucking leggings. Leggings, the stockings, or whatever. Water saw a jutsu. Next! Listen. This water dragon jutsu is not coming out fast enough. Because we're in a drought. Because we are in Miami Dade. That's right, because next up coming up to the estage, it's Malaysia Baby Doll Fox. And I apparently it was Malaysia Baby Doll, Baby Doll, Baby Doll, Baby Doll Fox. I'm Why? my baby bad, baby bad, baby bad. <laughs> That's all I thought about. Oh my god. Okay, Malaysia, for me, this was one of the better Beyonce looks because it was done with volume. Wig was volumed out. And then it matched the, like, not replica, but still done close it enough. It paid enough attention Homage. to the correct details of the original outfit for it to be executed pretty well, in my opinion. Even down to the neck piece. Correct. Uh, she had sunglasses, but Malaysia also had them big old lashes. So that counts. Lash! Um, <laughs> and I also like... 
her choice of color for Beyonce's hair because Beyonce went, loves her a little brown to dirty blonde to ombre She's going to put a little blonde in there somewhere. She, oh, my God. Are we the Beyonce fusion? What do you mean? Are you done? Are you slow? Oh. Girl, she's missing my little... <laughs> ding -a -ling -a -ling. Oh, Okay. For me, I think Malaysia followed the assignment and was one of the top looks for the category. So for the category of Night of a Thousand Beyonce's, this was the one where I would see it and I'd be like, okay, that looks like it's giving me Beyonce. I'm going to have to give Miss Malaysia baby doll, baby doll, baby doll Fox a nine. Just because I feel like out of the bunch, this was one of the top looks. And I like yes, it. Yes, I would have to agree. I would give her a nine too. Just because and the shape was just... I know everyone's complaining about the same silhouette, same whatever. She's a big girl, okay? Sometimes the people that the complain is that she likes to do an elegant gown. Let me be real. I would rather get a thousand be gown. Real. Be real. The water real. I would rather get a thousand gowns than a thousand bodysuits. Start speaking it. Come on, brush shake it up. Bah, bah, bah. That is also true. Because you can do so much silhouettes with a gown, you can only do so many with bodysuits. Listen. And there's a few that come out in bodysuits. And I don't know. I just, again. And even this. This was a bodysuit. But you see how she embellished the size. Yeah, it gave Hair shape gave still. volume still. Because she knew that she was going to have a bare leg. And then the, the thigh. The boots. It went up enough to, like, give it, like, it gives it a tall feel. Malaysia, you, you Compared to Duga, which is a zero. <laughs> like, come on. It speaks ah. for itself. The Hokages have spoken. No, that, the, Kage, the Hokage <laughs> has spoken. No, the Kages have spoken. Malaysia, nice across the board. Thank you for your wrong opinion. You seem to have many of those. Mustang. Quick and short, like my patients, we have Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. I'll go first. While this was not horrible. It missed the mark a little bit because, like Miss Kennedy Davenport said, girl, she looked like a bag of carpets. Girl, please. No. Sorry. Next. Listen, <laughs> if I have not said this once, a million times before through mm -hmm. all of these episodes, is that this is Marsha at the Sweet 16 Congeniality Ball. Again. She, again. Like, this is just Marsha cosplay to me. Like, it didn't really give Beyonce except for, what, the colors, mm -hmm. the hairstyle. It's like, I don't know. I don't know what Marsha could I'm gonna be have done. I'm going to be nitpicky because the hair was not styled the same. She just did an updo. But it was like That's it. low and then she put the ponytail up where Beyonce has all wig. Then the dress is supposed to be like a one piece kind of thing where she just went with her own like some like her own interpretation that's of what it. i'm saying it's like what is similar about it outside of the colors then no because then the colors beyonce's is like green. a vibrant jade i know green. being extra nitpicky on that but my point was just green and red that's literally the only thing and for some reason her carpet like shawl doesn't hit the same as beyonce's because beyonce's is like has volume and like a certain shape to it this is a flat rug <laughs> okay a bag of carpet. <laughs> I won't give it a zero because you did hit the assignment a bit, but she it, is very pretty. It's a three. Oh my like goodness. it's it's a oh, three. I'll just give it a three generous. to be fair because you didn't do bad, daughter, and you tried to match it to your own personality. It just wasn't my favorite look. Tbh. Okay, a three is fine. I was gonna give her a one, but you no, know, no, you can't take it away that she did. I hate the shoes. It's giving homage to Spies, to be quite honest. Honestly, truly. Next caller! <laughs> Coming up next, Sweet Tone, is... Sweet Tone. Mistress Isabel Brooks. Listen, this was such a smart idea. Very smart. She plays she's playing the radio Listen, role. Listen, this Muppet looks like she is... Eating her. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> so, it's funny that, like RuPaul said, you look gorgeous. On top of the fact that you made it campy, and yes. then the interpretation, the like the, the not the direct replica, but it was close enough where you could tell what it was doing. Yes. And again, so 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 smart to put the Muppets up here. For me, the water sweetie of the pageant 
it's going to be a 9 for me. It was really done well. I would have given it a 9.5 if the hair was maybe like something else. But I still think that the hair was top tier and above and beyond. I think the hair was great compared to Beyonce's flat blonde wig hair whatever true it's like everybody got a wig everyone has a wig so sorry but um i think isabel brooks look isabel brooks middle oh, school okay, principal. principal we are in the au <laughs> and you are the high school principal isabel brooks to my office <laughs> no but i love I, I think the puppets are were such a fucking funny idea funny. and they look crazy to me so which I don't is know. funny what would you be giving oh Miss my Mistress god Isabel and Brooks? i don't know if y'all peeped look she i don't know if that's like contour on the body but it's giving illusion of yes that points going all around for mistress yeah honestly i'm gonna because here's the thing yes you don't have to look exactly like beyonce because sure. you're not beyonce mm-hmm. okay you gotta play to your strengths but you know who she is because of the dummies on her shoulder so for that I'm gonna have to give her a 9.5. Oh! Yes. I would agree. Honestly, truly, because she just like exemplified like the beauty, the joke, the funny, and just being aware of the whole thing. And you followed the assignment. Following it's the intention. assignment. Like, like every thing in there has like its purpose in there. It just. Because we have to start being a little harsher well, with A little girls. more critical because I'm sorry, all of y'all are mid at best, and then. You want to be like, why am I not winning? Look like Lucy. That's the main person I'm talking about. <laughs> like she really came out looking like a flight attendant and talking about some. This don't give you Beyonce. That's like me showing up to be it's like giving Ellen DeGeneres. Doesn't this with give her you? Wig on. Oh my god! <laughs> not the inside jutsu of the leaf. Shush, shush, shush. Oh. <laughs> in the monastery. Oh, next up we have Miss Selena as Titties. I'm gonna sound controversial. Selena, you finally look good. Finally, it's happened to me. Listen, she just came out of the ball with the beast. Mm-hmm. Be my beauty. guest. Be my guest. No, but it's she fine looks, dining with the rest. She looks beautiful, and like the replication of like the, the netting and the top, gorgeous, and, and the hair, gorge. The fact that the color looks amazing on you. Because she picked that gilded yellow gold. And you did the hair, which is what I like when drag uh, girlies do. More! More! Honestly, Selena, for me, because the only thing I didn't like was her shoes. It's not pictured, but it was like... Mm. you know, it's, it's not pictured, so it don't count. Well, and the I, gown touches the ground. I'm just to, saying, for me. I need to take her to the water Charlotte Roofs <laughs> to get her a little. Not that doofus <laughs> ass pump. That would give her a. That would give her so many bad. Selena, points. you get an eight from me, daughter. She gets a nine from me. You have said everything I wanted to say mm-hmm. except for the shoes. That's blasphemous because it. The gown touches the ground, so her shoes don't really show at all to me and even still it's like yellow delicate slipper it's better than anitra's <laughs> ugly boots no uh-uh little <laughs> show please <laughs> little I stiletto i told you she was dookie coming up last to the stage is miss sasha colby okay. okay mixed feelings and before i start you go yes i I appreciate Sasha, and this is going to sound like the Miss Continental Sasha bias, but I promise you it's not, because we're going to judge it fairly, in my Sasha. opinion. Sasha. Not Sasha. Ra- okay, well. <laughs> you gathering me, but so many people, I feel like, have been calling her Sasha, and I'm like, we want Sasha on Drag Race, but that is Sasha Kobe. Yes. However, let's have a moment for Sasha However, let's have a moment for Stasha Sanchez. Wow. Groundbreaking. I love it. Anyways. Uh, So, Sasha came out and... Okay. The thing that at first... Yeah, you know, me and you are very picky when very simplistic looks come on the wrong way. And it's Mm -hmm. like, ugh, ugh, ugh. However, I will have to give points where credits are due. The reinterpretation is so good even to the hair and the thing that got me was the pasty on the leg yeah going up the body because it i'm going to have to give this i hate that i was gonna give it 
a six. I'm gonna give it an eight. It was really good. I just love well, okay. it. Okay, let me ask. Yeah. Let's be the interviewer here. Oh. So. Yes, Okage. Why would you have given it a six? I would have given it a six just because in usually in the Rain Village when we have to so portray a look that gives those classic dynasty, it would have been a little bit more embellished. But. We're so the a- lack of embellishments. You know what though? To kind of because I was kind of surprised you were gonna give her a six because I'm like, wow, maybe I'm being too generous. But the thing is, it's like, yes, she matches it perfectly. I was going to But it's a little too on the nose for me. It's you almost, know what I don't you know like what it the is? The length of the skirt. I don't like the uh, it's like It's ooh. not even that. It's a mat it's like the previous season, the one that did the Night of a Thousand Jails and someone straight up came out in the damn dress. dress. <laughs> like, come on! Come like, on, Miss Get Well, that was her doll door, Carrie. Ooh! <laughs> but that is hilarious because it sure was. Mm-hmm. But the thing is, is that it's like you said, maybe I would have liked a little bit more embellishments to make it a little bit more of like this is Sasha. Heavily inspiring, like, as Beyonce. But it was legit the outfit. Like, this is replica for replica. And I'm just like, that's nice, but it's kind of like... You know what? It's it's high safe. It which is. is why I gave it an 8. It was like, it's like... which I'll You know what we seven. are? You know what we are? We just want more. Because at this point, that is a little typical. It's kind of like, oh, wow, she came in the exact thing. And it's like... That, boo! You bought it? <laughs> like, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Like, even if you did buy it, like, do something with it. Like, Continental Girls? Thank you so much. For favor, for favor. We have come to a consensus. Kabuto, you have been warned, and you are now a criminal of all five nations. Goodbye. <laughs> Throw that in the garbage. <laughs> With you are also Obito and Duki Madara. To jail. But we've also took the scores into consideration and tallied them up. And the winner for RuPaul's Drag Race Season 15, Episode 10 of Pageant Perfection, Night of a Thousand Beyonce's is... Miss Mistress Isabel Brooks. And yes. Well, very well deserved. I feel like I could have done my little sweet tone reconsideration because I think I would have given it a 9.5 if, uh, like, going back, but there are no go-backs. We say what we nope, said. Nope, nope, nope. We've never edited anything else to give any other score. Lies on Manelli. Lies. <laughs> right. So, mistress, you're eating the... For me, she's just showing that she's such a well-rounded entertainer. Yes. Sometimes... A being a little goofy while being very pretty is kind of like the way to go. Unfortunately, like if you can make Rue laugh, you won, girl. You're in it. Considering how what happened to season five, but anyway, the thing is. read, <laughs> bitch. You can't read the doll, Mama. Y'all are still trying to figure out to do what the fuck I'm doing. How about that? The thing is. Why do you, every time you get a jab at me, why do you try to think and sell the things I love? Okay, but seriously though, Mm -hmm. I think that with that that versatility with Mistress, I think it really added to her because, I mean, Malaysia did good, but it's very much like... It's that extra. It's just that little bit of extra. You know, lately we have been getting tons of the Nitigritai and sometimes the difference in someone winning is 0.5. Like, that's just the reality. That's why I love pageants. Because if you understand that you're up to get critiqued and everything and woo 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 and all that, then you understand that it's up to interpretation. So it's not that you did bad or that she did bad or that it's a for the assignment. Like, for example, for the assignment, Lucy in the garbage. But, right, but, like... There are certain girls that just hit the mark. For example, Anitra, safe, but we didn't like the shoes. Sasha, safe, high safe, because reinterpretation, re- like, 
everybody's interpretation of the assignment sometimes will get judged differently. Yeah. Because because I see it as effort. What ahead. effort did you put in there besides getting the actual outfit and just putting it on? Because then we have to be like, well, technically Beyonce wore that bit or so. Ooh. And the thing is, that's why, like, with Anitra, like, her, there was, even though she did outfit for outfit, it still had its differences that made it likable. Freaking titties had one that was more likable. Gorgeous. And like, finally. the Chia Pet Rue prop was, like, a good idea. They, so, they were talking about, oh, we didn't like it. And I was like, no, I like that. I thought that was, it added that element of, like. And this is the most elegant and, like, solidly put together that Selena has looked in, like, Thank God, because if, if she pulled one more hot Cheeto out her pussy, girl. If I saw any hot Cheetos in this episode, it was over for her. No more hot Cheeto juice. 